Hello Light Travelers, today we're taking a look at the AT Slim Rivet Pants in the shadow cutaway from a brand called Western Rise. These are quite similar in style and function to the slim dungarees, and definitely what I'd call a solid replacement for your jeans. They're made from a rather hefty 280 GSM blend of 97% nylon and 3% spandex, which to some may feel a bit warm to wear in the summer, especially if you feel that 200 GSM merino wool is too hot in the summer. In terms of sizing, they are a very nice fit, and in a size 30 fit me well without needing a belt, whereas the slim dungarees in a size 30 feel a bit more roomy, especially after they've stretched out, and I need a belt for them. The AT slim rubber pants also don't seem to stretch out after a bit of wear, which is a good thing because I don't like having to wear a belt with the pants. Another good thing is the inseam is proportional to the size. The 30 waist comes in a 32 inseam and the 32 waist comes in a 33 inseam and so on. In terms of functionality it's got quite a few neat features. They've got a water resistant coating that repels water as you can see here. Although as usual with water resistant coatings it wears off rapidly on the upper thigh area and after only a few weeks of use any water that spills in your thighs would just soak in, which is a shame because it's the main area that you need water resistance in. This of course can be remedied by washing some water repellent coatings back in, like Nick Wax. On the plus side, it does dry very quickly and often within about 30 minutes. Another neat feature is that Rather than a coin pocket, these pants have a phone pocket. The coin pocket is much larger and deeper than your usual jean pocket, allowing space to store a phone. But I mainly use them to store my sunglasses. It's a bit impractical to use for coins because it's so hard to reach your fingers down to the bottom to retrieve them. Speaking of pockets, in the back there's also a hidden zippered pocket to keep your wallets more secure. Finally, in terms of pricing, the pants come in at 129 US dollars which is a fantastic price, especially when you compare them to Outlier's Slim Dungarees that come in at almost $200. These are currently my go-to pants and the ones that I'm going to wear when I'm traveling and just out and about. My only suggestion for improvement would be to offer more colorways and maybe make the front rise a bit higher. So that's it, thanks very much for watching and a quick shout out to Ian, thank you very much for sending me out the pants. And be sure to stay subscribed to keep up to date with future videos.